Hey, we are living in the world of subscription pricing and products, but are these subscriptions draining your bank account? Let's talk about ways that you can save money on these subscriptions and put more money in that emergency fund and pay down that debt. Hey, it's Brad Nelson with Balance Sense Financial Coaching, bringing you more tips today to help you save money and pay off debt so that you too can melt away your financial stress and live a debt-free life. Hey, we are turning our focus to saving money. And every week we are gonna be tackling a new way to save on things that you're already doing. Pretty awesome. And by taking action and doing some of these simple tips that we're gonna be share, you can build your very first emergency fund, maybe even pay down your credit cards and other debt as well. Pretty sweet. Now, the next one we're gonna be talking about is subscriptions and monthly subscription plans. Now, this pricing is all the rage right now. You know, TV, software, you know, clubs, product boxes, clothing, pet supplies, leadership tools, entrepreneur boxes, weight loss, healthy eating, and the list goes on and on. Subscription-based pricing is fantastic in many ways because you can get great services for an affordable monthly price. Even our online membership site, Roots of Personal Finance, is a subscription-based service. It's built to make financial coaching and accountability affordable for anyone that wants help to get on track with their finances. And it's helping our members save and pay off millions of dollars for an incredibly low investment for them. But I also see subscription-based services punching a lot of holes in people's bank accounts. Now, in a past blog post, I you talked about having a leaky bucket. And a leaky bucket can drain your bank account and keep you from being able to save and pay off debt. That's not a good plan, and I don't recommend that. One of the things that I hear all the time is it's only a few dollars a month. Now, this saying, it's only will eat up your income in no time. You know, when it comes to low-cost subscriptions and products, it's easy to overlook the cost. But now multiply that by five subscriptions, 10 or 15 of these things, and now you have a pretty hefty amount of your income going out every single month towards these low-cost products. That is a leaky bucket. So the things you gotta ask yourself is, does it provide you real value? Lots of things are nice to have, but are they a necessity of daily living? In most cases, probably not. Remember, we are looking for as many ways as we can to save money to build that emergency fund and pay down that debt. Now, most of these subscriptions aren't helping you achieve that goal. They're actually probably keeping you from it. By all means, keep the ones that bring great value to you, but ditch the ones that are just kind of nice to have. And with just a few simple changes and spending a little time, you can save yourself tons of money freeing up cash to save your first emergency fund and pay down your debts. So go ahead, check your bank account, what subscriptions are coming out and which ones can you get rid of and how can you use that money to build that emergency fund and pay down debt right now. Hey there, if you'd like to continue the conversation with other people who are working their way out of debt and saving and you wanna surround yourself with like-minded people, join us in our free Facebook group called Life Without Payments. We'd love to see you there. Click on the button below to join and I can't wait to start talking to you here in our free group.